the uh, Trumpet Studio is six students. We now have free tuition and a stipend on top of that. They obviously all take private lessons every week. We have a studio class and I see almost all of the students in one of the ensembles. I coach either a uh, brass quintet and the early music group. So uh, we spend a lot of time between faculty and student here. If you talk to any trumpet player, <laughs> they will say that Alan Dean is one of their heroes. Like, he's just one of the most legendary players there ever was. Like, he's taught some of the best trumpet players in the world, and he's been teaching for over 50 years, so I mean, he pretty much can help you with any kind of issue you have, just because he's seen everything. Most of our kids have had very good training up to now. Most of them come from very good teachers in very good conservatories or music schools from around the country, and we become uh, more of a guide than a teacher in many ways. You learn a lot through osmosis. Like he, he can do things on the trumpet that most people really can't even get close to. So just kind of being around him and kind of seeing how he approaches those things makes you want to go into the practice room and really sort of stretch your boundaries as well. I find the kids taking great advantage of the Yale community. It's one of the main recruiting tools I have when I try and talk somebody into coming here. So it's a great music school, but look what else you have available to you when you're in a place like New Haven. There's like a lot, a lot of space and room to kind of be creative and take your time here and really do whatever it is you want to do. I think in a graduate school you start to think outside the loop a little bit more sometimes and uh, trying to broaden your intellectual horizons. That's an availability here that's better than anywhere. Yeah. Different approach. Yep. Good.